let us take weight of nickel sulfate we need 2 gram of nickel sulfate for the synthesis of nickel hexamide sulfate we will uh, synthesize nickel hexamide sulfate from nickel sulfate okay so the process is to take 2 gram of nickel sulfate and uh, dissolve it in 5 ml distilled water so we'll transfer this nickel sulfate to 150 ml beaker and uh, you can see this is 5 ml distilled water now we'll transfer this 5 ml distilled water into it and uh, little hydrochloric acid which is too normal we'll add it into it okay and uh, let us dissolve this Okay, so it is dissolved. Very few particles are left behind. You can see here. Okay, if it is not dissolving, we'll add a uh, either one one ml distilled water to it. Okay, so this is around. 1 ml distilled water we have added to it then so you can see very good greenish color is there ok so I will keep white tile below it Okay, so in resolving this nickel sulfate into distilled water and remember I have already added two normal hydrochloric acid to it. Okay, so I think it is dissolved. So let's filter it. Okay, so this is nickel sulfate solution. We'll filter this solution. Okay, so we have just filtered this nickel and nickel sulfate solution. Now, so this is ammonia solution. Okay, so for safety, I kept watch glass on it, and uh, this is our filtered nickel sulfate solution. Now into it, we'll add drop wise ammonia solution. And uh, we'll stir it. Okay. So we'll add ammonia solution till the smell of ammonia comes out of this beaker. You can see there is a little change in the color. Let us see what happens. Okay, you can observe change in color. There is little there is deepening in the color. this You can see color is changing.
will add more ammonia to it. Still there is no smell of ammonia coming out of this beaker, we will add more ammonia to it. There is bluish tint in the color. Initially, remember that color was greenish here. The color is almost changed to blue. Okay, let us check whether it is giving smell of ammonia or not. Okay, just uh, we'll check it. Okay, now smell of ammonia is coming out from this beaker now this is time to add alcohol to it okay so this is ethyl alcohol i will add this ethyl alcohol about 40 ml of ethanol to it with stirring you can see the changes that takes place with the addition of ethanol you can see there is a bit color change and the PPT of the complex is now separating we added about 50 ml of ethyl alcohol to this solution ok so we will add 5 more ml and we will keep it for about 15 minutes in cold bath ok this is our water bath here to it we'll have ice cold water uh, you can see turbidity of water that shows the water is ice cold okay now to this water bath we'll keep our complex for about 15 minutes so that the crystals are separated very well our uh, complex is almost synthesized okay uh, we'll keep it for about 15 minutes in the water bath so the precipitate of nickel hexamine sulfate separates out and settle down then later we'll filter it so set up a filter paper here for uh, filtration purpose Okay. We'll uh, filter our complex through this. It is about almost 15 minutes. So after 15 minutes, we are filtering our complex. Okay. So let us start filtering our complex. Okay. So carefully pour supernatant liquid. So you can see the complex uh, have settled down. I use filter paper. So the complex is now collected here in the filter paper. To the bottom we have a lot of complex. We'll transfer it to filter paper carefully. complex is collected here okay we'll wash uh, the same beaker with the same filtrate okay okay, okay so our complex is, is about to filter okay. You can see very good uh, precipitate of complex is settled inside the filter paper. Okay. So filtration process is going on. You can see. 
you can see complex is filtered here this is our final product which we have dried in filter paper and uh, this is nickel hexamine sulfate complex okay thank you for watching stay tuned for another video